northern lights make an appearance. No, I've never seen anything like this ever. The whole town comes out to witness them. Just to kind of stop and take in that moment. Yeah, it was, it was a little, getting a little choked up thinking about it now. If you've seen the Northern Lights, you may have wondered, why do they look so much brighter in pictures than they do in person? Because of light pollution, they may not be green. They may be white. Your cameras have sensors that gets that, that noise pollution down to a minimum and turns them back green. Seattle photographer Tim Durkin has been chasing the Northern Lights for years. He says they may appear more colorful on camera because your eyes don't capture light the same way as your camera lens. Sometimes they're red, depending upon whether or not that, uh, those electrically charged particles are interacting with the nitrogen in the atmosphere or the oxygen. So they can turn emerald green, they can be nice dark red. When you're trying to capture a stunning shot of the aurora, Tim offers these tips. You can get a picture on, on a modern cell phone. You'll need a tripod or need to set the camera up somewhere where you, it's nice and stable. And if you've got a DSLR camera. Get a tripod, number one. Shutter release button, number two. The less shake you have in the camera, the more clear whatever you have in the, in the foreground is, is gonna be sharp and in focus. If your camera has the ability, Tim says a time lapse is the way to go. You set your exposure to about once every two seconds. Do it over the you know, 15, 20 minute period at the height. As soon as you see the first pillar occurring, hit the go button on that time lapse and it'll blow your mind. And wherever you are, make sure it's really dark. The further north you go, the further out of the city lights into nature, the better chance you are, are gonna see the northern lights. Once you're there, sit back and enjoy the show. It's also a moment to just kind of uh, commune with nature. You're, you're about to see something that uh, you can imagine what they thought of 100, 500, 1,000 years ago when they looked up to the skies and saw this event going on. It still is just one of the most amazing sights you can really see.